Good morning, Dominic. Thank you for taking the time talking about the Q3 results. So how was the performance in the quarter? Yeah, Katarina, good morning uh, uh, from my side also. Um, I think performance was okay. Uh, first nine months, uh, results are significantly up. However, we have to be fair, Q3 was a hefty quarter for us. Uh, rising energy costs, rising freight costs. So uh, results are a little bit down versus a very strong comparison uh, last year. Still the second best quarter in our company's history, but nevertheless, uh, results are down. Uh, all in all, I have to say the team has done an excellent job. It will stay rough, but uh, uh, well done uh, in Q3 from my perspective. What can we expect for the rest of the year? Yeah, it will be a, a tough fight until year end. That's why we have launched a business excellence program worth 500 million uh, euros to really mitigate the cost increase that targets to both operational excellence, 150 uh, million euros, and very importantly, commercially and pricing more than 350 million euros in order to reach our guidance uh, for year end and get well into 22. And what will be our strategic focus for the next year and the years to come? Well, first of all, very importantly for us, the markets must work. So demand is intact uh, across the globe. That's good news. Secondly, now also in light with COP26, we will be and continue to be the leader in carbon capture utilization and storage. We'll go up to 10 million tons uh, before and by 2030. That's a massive step uh, forward. And last but not least, digitalization. We start to capture digital additional revenues uh, for Heidelberg Cement. Exciting. Looking forward to it. Thank you, Dominic. Thanks, Carolina.